Morris in the plunger. In the air, oh, he's dropped it. Monroe's got it. What a good catch. That's a great catch. One lovely take. And again, the open face. We saw it the previous delivery. England bowling a full length, drawing him into his stroke. Well done, Chris Lewis. Nicely taken by Graham Hick, going to his left. Lewis, don't think he's been all that impressive this morning, really. But now he's pitching the ball up far, far more than they were doing at uh, Lords. That one left him slightly off the pitch. Oh, Hick didn't take it so well after all. <laughs> again, he was going to his left, and this time it went to uh, Russell. Hick does drop a lot of catches going to his left. You have to say, he dropped that one as well, but fortunately, Russell took it, and he's out for nine now in Mongia. India are 33 for two. And take it, what a catch! That's a stunning catch! Sensational catch, he's celebrating! It's happening, it's happening for Bermuda. Lever up the catcher. He's on the lap of on the where is he? He ain't over there, he's miles away, here he is, the big man, the fridge has opened! He's flown like a gazelle! I can't believe it, a brilliant catch! Boys, you need another nine wickets. The game isn't over. He sets off now. He's on his way. The earth shook. What a catch. Oh, what a catch. The big man. He's off. And we get a dance as well. That is a catch. You're joking. He's been smashed into Sean Lang and he's out. And he got held on the body. There he goes, not even looking, and it's in. But because he'd made cricket history by taking this amazing catch in his trouser pocket. Absolutely amazed. Let's take another look at that. Trot fielding at short leg. The ball gets caught in his pocket, and that's out. There are some things they don't. Uh, all at a laugh, and I hope to catch the next one for my hands, right? In all my experience, I've never seen anything like it in my life, so... Standard short leg, only a few feet away from a hard-hitting... Oh! Yes, the second down run. Well, Graham did he deserve that luck. Fantastic routine, this. Gooch getting both hands to the ball, out it pops. French quickly reacts, that's a fine piece of wicket-keeping. And scoops the ball up, and now West Ham United come into the act. And what about that? No easy task either. Take it, take it. Yeah. Oh, is that? Oh, oh, is that a freak? It, it is a freak. It's a freak end for Andrew Simons. You'd almost never see it, and you certainly can't believe it, whoever you are. You just gotta have a giggle. Certainly the batsman can't believe it, the non-striker can't believe it. Andrew Simons uh, clipped it pretty firmly in the air. It's hit Michael Clark on the leg, perhaps on the pad, and rebounded straight to mid-wicket. And uh, there's the nod from the umpire, and I'm sorry, mate, you're on your way. It's 5 for 238. There you go. Cut. Try to hit it over the bars. <laughs> well, he's gone. Caught and ball. Confusion. <laughs> Confused the commentary box totally. It was a pause, and Chiminda Vaz has taken a catch, and he was almost swatting. It was like swatting a fly. He's just picked it out of the air, and another Bangladesh wicket comes to an end. Nobody had a clue what happened. Was made it so easy. Look at that. Oops. I think he was trying to save his head. And he just grabbed it. Beauty. 
and then there was the turn of the umpire. I've caught it, I've caught it, and there he is. Mashud gone for 19, 172 for seven. Has he caught that? Has he caught that? Going to his right. There was a bobble or two. Wonderful work from Chris Gale. Well, it went in and then went out of his hand, I think. Yep, I thought it did. Oh, <laughs> oh an acrobat. Well done, lad. Terrific. Yes. Well done. I thought he dropped it, but he dropped it twice and then caught it. Yeah, good effort. Yeah, you give credit where it's due. It's out. That's all that matters for West Indies. 1 of 40 for 2, Amla for 37. Pakistan needed a cameo from him, but this is what happened to his innings. Shaki Bulasan, tumbling effort in the end, got a bit of help from Miss Paul Huck. Hit him on the body and part of helmet, and the ball ballooned up once again in the air. Off Miss Ma's body. Had a bit of luck. Oh, he's got him. Yes, he's out. Caught. He's caught. He's got him caught. Why did he do it? Why did he charge down the pitch and go for it? Well, I suppose if he had hit it in the middle of the bat, it would have ended up in the stands. As it turned out, a little edge. It was actually dropped, fumbled, if you like, by the keeper and uh, caught at first slip. Yes, she goes. Just got it there. And Callis is waiting. Gotcha. Mark Walk. 34 of 35 was doing it well. Advanced, try to be positive. That's what Australia are going to try to do today. Try and get a big total, unfortunately. He departs for 34. 2 for 76. In the air. And the, oh, yes, he's got him. I can't believe it. That is so lucky. Whoa, this is what happens. You can't wish to go more for you. Have a look at this. Oh, it's gone underneath that one again. Catch it is the call. It's going to go to him. It's all. Oh, it's been taken. Is he coming back? It is flicked it back again. Oh, dear. Did he touch the ball? He's taken it. That's... I don't think I've seen that before. I've seen it flicked back once. Flicked back twice and caught. I don't think I've ever seen that myself either. <laughs> the umpire just calming everybody down. He took the catch. It's popped out. Sees the boundary rope there. Tosses it in the air, so up until this stage, everything's okay. Out the, the boundary he goes. And gets himself back into the boundary. Whether his foot is touching the boundary there. Yeah, that's going to be six. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Shomo Sharka, what a brilliant effort. But it's the second goal when you see that when he touches the ball with his hands, his foot possibly touching that uh, triangle of the advertising there, there you see the ball in hand and there's his foot. That means it's a six. Very, very unfortunate. A brilliant effort by Shomo Sharkar.